What's up everybody, my name is Phil and welcome to Miranda Detailing where we make satisfying detailing videos. In today's video, we're going to be reviewing Chemical Guy's Silk Shine Dress. So guys, this stuff has been in the market for a long, long time and uh, I've used all sorts of different water-based dressings, but I wanted to give this one a shot and I gotta say that I do like it. So there's a couple of reasons why I like this product. Let me show you why. First of all, this product is water-based and it's pretty liquidy. So it's not a super thick product. I like to use Meguiar's New Car Shine, which that stuff is pretty thick. I like that. I like to be able to apply it uh, onto a brush and it really does stick to the plastic. It's very easy to apply in and it's nice to apply. However, you really can't spray the product onto the tire. Now, some guys like to spray the product onto the surface of the tire. Some like to spray it onto a brush or an applicator. It all kind of depends on the tire. Sometimes you get those low profile tires and spraying it on a brush or a foam applicator is just easy. But then sometimes you get huge truck tires and they're tedious to brush every single nook and cranny of those tires. Yes, the, those green brushes do help, but sometimes they're just so knobby. So what do you do? That's where this product comes in. So let me show you what we mean. So guys here, the tire was cleaned. It's nice and dry. And even if it does have a little bit of water, it's not a big deal. You're dealing with a water-based product anyway. So simply spray onto the tire. You don't have to overdo it. Just a couple of spritz. Just make sure that the rubber is coated evenly with the product and simply let it sit. Now this stuff actually does produce a pretty high gloss depending on the rubber of the tire. Some tires absorb dressing so much that they barely look like they've even been dressed at all. And other tires don't absorb it so the product will sit on top, which depending on your preference, if you like super glossy or if you like a more matte finish, then here's what you can do. If you want the glossy look, simply leave it alone. Or if you want to even it out, take a brush and even out the dressing on the tire. Or if you want to knock it down a little bit, take a microfiber towel and wipe the tire down. It'll dry it, making it a more satin finish. Now this stuff smells really good. It says that it has a new car scent. I don't know what that means, but it just smells fresh to me. Uh, it doesn't have a coconut smell. It doesn't have a sweet smell. It just, it just smells nice and fresh. Some scents are just hard to define, but I do like the scent. It, it actually does smell really, really nice. So this stuff does say that it has UVA and B protection, pH balance formula. I don't really care about that. Non-oily, greasy, or sticky residue. I have to say... It's not sticky, but any dressing is going to be slightly oily or greasy. Um, that's just the nature of the product. It's not a big deal. That's basically what it is. Rubbers and plastics are going to need some sort of oils for them to absorb and stay dark and rich and repel water. So that's fine with me. As long as you're not over applying it and it's just saturated and really greasy, then that's when you get problems with dirt and other dust and things sticking to it. And then it looks worse than it was before. So I got to say, guys, I do like this product. Let me know if you use it. I may be switching over from my other dressing to this stuff just because I like the formula. I like that it is a little bit more watery. You can spray it onto the tire and that actually quickens up your detail job as well because you can spray it on, say, right after you wash and dry the vehicle and then do your interior work, come back, wipe down the tire and everything is absorbed and dry to the touch and looking really, really nice. That's my thoughts on the Chemical Guys Silk Shine Dressing. Really like this stuff. I'll be getting more of it and like I said, perhaps switching over to using this product this summer. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, like it, share with others who may enjoy it, and let me know if you use this product. Uh, do you like it? Do you not like it? Give me the pros and cons. Give me the reasons why you like it or dislike it. And uh, 
yeah, let me know what you think. If you haven't already, consider subscribing and clicking that bell. That way you get notifications each time our videos drop each week and you don't miss stuff. And if you're interested in any of the merchandise, the shirts, or the cord snaps that we offer, then click up there. That goes to our dedicated store where you can pick up any of those products with 15% off with Miranda 15. And guys, if you want to check out this product, I have links down below. Or again, click up there. That goes to a dedicated page on our website where we have tools and products where you can simply click on those pictures and it leads you right to Amazon so you can purchase a bunch of stuff easily. So thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Have a great week.